Now we're back to mid journey. Another update in version 6 is that we now have two upscale options. And that is prompt for example a comic character, the Joker. We'll make it highly detailed and we use parameter minus minus v version 6. And by the way, you can also go to settings and just set your default version to v6 alpha, which is the current version 6. So here's our result. Let me upscale number 3 maybe. We use that. And here we have two upscale options now which are new in version 6. We can use subtle or creative. Let us do both. When it comes to size comparison, the upscaler is a 2x as far as I can tell. So by default you get 1024 times 1024. And when you use the upscale it's 2048. So if I don't mess around with the aspect ratio, this is what you get with this new v6 upscaler. Now let's check the difference between creative and subtle. Let me open them up and we'll compare all three. So on the left we have our original, that's not upscaled, it's the 1024 pixels. And in center we have the creative and on the right it's a subtle. And if you compare especially the scars, you can see that on the forehead and on the chin, the creative it takes itself more freedom and it's gotten rid in the process of these scars, while the subtle it keeps the scars. So it's way closer to the original that you've upscaled. Well, the creative, I would almost say it does a little bit of photo retouching. Let us zoom in. For example, here we'll check the mouth. In the original, we've got a little bit of, what is it, saliva. And it gives that in the subtle. It's obviously more detailed now due to the upscale. But this will be gone in the creative one. So as I've said, it's more like a photo retouching upscale. Check the texture, on the left yet again the original and the subtle it's closer to it. And the creative, it's a little bit of a free interpretation of what we had initially. It's a cool feature I think, try it out yourself. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.